Okay, let's start with our wonderful vegetables. So ideally we want to get organic vegetables and we want to eat vegetables in a range of colours. And that's because the different colours represent different pigments and those pigments have therapeutic properties in their own right. And I'll talk about some of those in a bit more detail in a moment. But the other thing I'd really like to highlight is that you ideally want where possible to buy local and in season. And, you know, there's a few reasons for that. And of course, if we buy local, then yes, we're, we're supporting local growers, the community, which is wonderful. But the other thing we've got to consider is that if vegetables and fruits are transported, then you don't know how long they've been in storage for. And if they have been transported from another country, then the chances are they've had to be fumigated to meet with quarantine requirements. Now, you take something like a carrot. A mature carrot can be left in cool storage for up to nine months. And yes, it's in, in a temperature controlled condition, but it doesn't mean that it's going to retain all its nutrients. So these are the kind of things that we want to consider. If we're not eating in season, then how have we got access to that vegetable? It's probably been in cool storage again, or it's been imported, which means it's had to travel, which again means that it's likely been exposed to chemicals to meet with quarantine regulations. So thinking of our vegetables, they contain an absolute array of nutrients, macro, micronutrients, lots of, of phytochemicals. So phyto means plant. It's the Greek word for, for plant. And when we say phytochemical, we're saying, well, a plant chemical or plant compound. And our phytochemicals can have some amazing therapeutic properties. So we'll take a closer look. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe below so you don't miss any future content. To learn more about CNM or its courses, head to www.naturopathy.com hyphen uk.com